Wet feet suck. <laughs> it's where you bring sandals and then put your boots in the thing, in the pack or haversack or whatever. Put them in a plastic bag. Well, mosquito heaven. So I've got mosquitoes, wood ticks. Uh, so I guess spring's here, right? I'm gonna make a chair. And I found a nice dead log here, but I'm going to pull it out of this mosquito nest. Okay, I had an idea on the way down here, and I'm going to try it out. Okay, here's my pack of the day. It's a field line, uh, real thin camel. Got my uh, bandana stuffed outside, real thin material. Uh, very nice, but I mean, you've got to put structure inside of it. I need to attach a hook and cord so I can hook this thing around trees without rigging something up but uh, bank line Mora classic <laughs> with thumb guards and uh, cheap Corona saw okay so this is working pretty good I don't have a tripod but you get the idea here well this bank line broke Okay, that's about the most simple elemental stool design I could come up with. I cut some slots to hold the line down. I also brought it down there. Uh, I, cut, I guess I could have cut it and made some more slots on the side and then put the string in there. But I think I would have got it tighter if I would have cut slots up here, but I had already trimmed the center down. So I didn't really want to take a chance on cutting through it, but I'm going to try it out here. Okay guys, it seems to be working. I mean, you got to maintain your balance, but I mean, that only took a couple minutes, and it is going to be a break. That's where if you spent more time on that joint right there, it would give you more left to right stability. Or for that matter, you could lash from like a triangle to slot just take your saw blade and cut a little slot but for a preliminary design I kinda like it okay guys now that I'm back at uh, base camp uh, I'm gonna do a little wrap up uh, I've been watching some of my videos and it seems like I never <laughs> put a period at the end of them where is it? put a period at the end so uh, yeah, the idea behind that one is just for a crafting stool to, or, you know, when you're attending to fire, uh, just something quick that you can put together, get you off the ground. Uh, it's not self-supporting, so you just got to carry it around with you. I, I used it a little bit more than in the video there, and I still got it out there. Um, the phase two of that would be to make it a bipod or a tripod. So, or just to make the logs bigger and then it would be self-supporting, but it's not even really critical to me that it's self-supporting. The whole idea there uh, that I had was, uh, you know, using it to sit around the fire and so on. Uh, so that's it. Uh, I don't think you can get more uh, simple than that design there. And... Uh, Get you uh, familiar with tools. I should have uh, practiced more on my knots because it's no time to be thinking about knots when you need them. So it's always uh, I'm going to have to get a little training routine of using my knots all the time because uh, when you need when you need it, that's when you need to know how to do it. So, all right, have a good one, guys.